All right, it's day six of this Korean radish series. Uh, first, let's look at the foliage up close. It looks a little bit more developed. It's been 24 hours since the last filming. And if you look at the bottom, the root system I've been spraying more often with distilled water. It has these new roots that have a fuzzy white moldy appearance until you examine them closely and realize that's not mold at all. They just have these little tiny, really, really fine, ultra fine bristles to increase the surface area for absorption. So whether that's for water or responding to a lack of nutrients, I don't know, but um, it seems very interesting. The default roots in the supermarket specimens didn't have any of this. It seems like there are just a lot more new roots and new mass coming from the top. The existing root maybe was dried out and damaged. All right, so I prepared a bottle of fertilizer in spray form, distilled water plus some miracle Grow. It has the nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium needed for growth. Get this a lot closer and I'll show you how I typically water. So I just do some gentle sprays like that. Now I think the fertilizer will really help this and accelerate the growth. It's a dilute concentration, so hopefully it doesn't burn anything. And the other thing is, you know, I was thinking about just wrapping this up in aluminum foil. So the tuber has light reflected away from it. And this will shield the roots from uh, the harsh LED light, which causes a lot of evaporation. So it's not an optimal setup or anything, but I'll try that for a while and see if things go a lot better. It's day 11. I think these are three flower bouquets in the making, you know, left, right, and top. The leaves at the bottom have developed a little bit more, but the speed at which they're developing is nowhere near as rapid as the ones surrounding the flowers. It's good that there's some leaf mass going on in the surface area, so there's a photosynthesis. The tuber has lost quite a bit of mass. Remember, it used to be in a wider cup. Now it's barely wider than this cup, and I have it fizzing in a newly brewed solution of 0 0.3 to 0.4% hydrogen peroxide with a blue crystalline miracle Grow powder. Like, I think it was maybe, this is equivalent to maybe one-sixth of a packet or even less, maybe one-seventh, something like that. And it has fertilizer pellets dissolving to provide the rest of the micronutrients.